Ladies and gentlemen, the police are looking for Jonathan Major's ex-girlfriend, and they're saying she's out of the country. So they don't know where she is, but she's not in the U.S. So Jonathan Major's trial postponed. Now his trial was set for September 6th. So they are postponing it, and they're looking for her now, Grace Jabari. Now, if you remember, because of what she said happened, he got charged with two counts of third-degree assault, aggravated harassment, and attempted assault, based on her word, back in March. So the attorney representing Major says he was really the victim, and they had apparently video footage of them out on the streets where the incident actually started. So it was recorded. This is why Jonathan Majors never had any further things happen to him. Once he was arrested that day, really nothing else has happened. And now, based on video footage, they are looking for his ex-girlfriend. So they said, um, you know, she is out of the country. And his attorney said this is due to the fact that the prosecutors did not turn over evidence promptly. So they gave her ample time to go and do whatever she wanted instead of, you know, going after her, especially once they had the evidence. The domestic assault trial against the Creed three star has been pushed back until next month. So apparently his original court date was August 3rd and now it is September 6th. So many outlets misreported what happened to Jonathan Majors. And you know what? You would think he would be able to sue people because the information was misrepresented. You know, most outlets made it seem like he did something to her. And it was all these other victims. And we haven't even heard about these alleged other victims. We don't even know who they are. So we know since all of this was reported initially back in March, it ruined his reputation and career. It has not been the same for him ever since. So according to Black Enterprise, the NYPD is now looking for the accuser. Major's ex-girlfriend, Grace Jabari, who allegedly is now out of the country. So due to the prosecutor's failure to turn over evidence promptly. This is what his attorney is saying, that they gave her ample time to leave the country, you know, instead of acting right away when they had the evidence to get her. Many outlets have misreported what happened on Jonathan Major's August 3rd court date, falsely claiming that I made a motion to delay the trial, and that was untrue, according to his lawyer. Major's defense lawyer said in a written statement provided to Newsweek, the prosecution confessed to its unpreparedness, pushing the trial date to September 6. I represented no motions. I did not ask to delay the trial. There were no motions before the court. No, they're delaying it because they can't find her, which means they are the ones that dropped the ball on this whole thing. See, on his last court date, I believe it was back in June or July, when it came out that his ex-girlfriend lied, she should have been picked up right away. They didn't pick her up right away. They're all of a sudden looking for her now and she's gone, she's not even in the country. She continued, Jonathan Majors has been uh, waiting for 132 days to clear his name of these false allegations while the NYPD waits to arrest the accuser 
upon her New York return. In June, Majors filed a complaint against Jabari, whom he alleged physically assaulted him on March 25th, the night that he allegedly, you know, they made the claim that he attacked her and he was arrested. Chandri claimed that Major later went on to the police station to present himself with evidence. So he went up to the police station willingly and gave evidence on what happened that night and alleged Jabari was drunk and hysterical during the incident. And even when he showed the evidence, the prosecutors did not press charges against Jabari, despite police having enough reason to investigate her. Mm -mm -mm. So they're saying, you know, if he was found guilty, he could be looking at up to a year in jail, especially if they went according to her alibi. I mean, his career is already jacked up. So his attorney says, Jonathan Major is completely innocent and is probably the victim of an altercation with a woman he knows. We are quickly gathering and presenting evidence to the DA with the expectation that all charges will be dropped. So this is what his attorney said in a statement. Wow. Y'all gonna have to tell me what you think about this new turn of events. And, you know, I kind of agree with the lawyer. You know, NYPD has dragged their feet on this whole thing instead of arresting this woman. So as you know, he is now dating Megan Good and he broke up with Grace Jabari right after this whole thing went down and he started losing everything. And we, we saw the text messages back then. You know, he was pretty much done with her then. But y'all, please tell me what you think about this video. Please leave your comment and subscribe. Don't forget to hit on the notification bell. And I'll see you on the next video. Peace, family.